Lecture number 11, development of recipes for new types of canned food. Plan of the lecture, development of recipes for new types of canned food, calculation of energy value, consideration of canned products in the production of new products, application of modern processes in the production of canned food. Development of recipes for new types of canned food. Canned foods are usually sterilized after they have been packed so that they can and the content are heated together to 120 Celsius or above for a predetermined period of time, normally 30 minutes, so that in order to carry out migration tests on such cans, one should use the relevant food stimulants and observe the time and temperature conditions. What does canning do? Canning is an important safe method for preserving food if practiced properly. The canning process involves placing foods in jars or similar containers and heating them to a temperature that destroy microorganisms that cause food to spoil. During this heating process, air is driven out of the jar and uh, as it cools, a vacuum seal is formed. This vacuum seal prevents air from getting back into the product, bringing with the contaminating microorganisms. Safe canning methods. There are two safe ways of processing food of boiling water bath method and the pressure canned canner method. First one, the boiling water bath method is safe for tomatoes, fruits, jams, jellies, pickles, and other preserves. In this method, jars of food are heated, completely covered with boiling water, uh, 212 Fahrenheit, and cook it for a specified amount of time. Second one, pressure canning is, uh, is the only safe method of preserving vegetables, meats, poultry, and seafood. Jars of food are placed in two to three inches of water in a special pressure cooker, which is heated to temperature of at least 240 Fahrenheit. This temperature can be only reached using the pressure method, a microorganism's Cold Clostridium botulium is the main reason why pressure processing is necessary. So the bacterial cells are killed at boiling temperature. They can form spores that can withstand this temperature. The spores grow well in low acid foods in the absence of air, such as in canned low acidic foods like meats and vegetables. When the spores begin to grow, they produce the deadly botulinum toxins poisons. The only way to destroy these spores is by pressure cooking the food at the temperature of 240 Fahrenheit or above for a specified amount of time depending on the type of food and altitude. Foods that are low acid have a pH of more than 4.6 and because of the danger of botulism, they must be prepared in a pressure canner. The low acidic foods include meat, seafood, poultry, dairy products, all vegetables. High acid foods have a pH of 4.6 uh, or less and contain enough acids so that the Clostridium botulinum spores can not grow and produce a deadly toxin. High acidic foods can be safely canned using the boiling water mass method. The high acidic foods include fruits, properly pickled vegetables, certain foods like tomatoes and figs that have a pH value close to 4.6 need to have acid added to them in order to use the water bath method. This is uh, accomplished by adding lemon juice of critic acid. 
canning equipment water bath canner a uh, bath, uh, water bath canner is a large cooking pot with a tight fitting lid and a wire or wooden rack that keeps jars from touching each other the rack allows the boiling water to flow around and the underneath jars for a more even processing of the contents the rack also keeps jars from bumping each other and cracking or breaking if a rack is not available clean cut and dish towels or similar can be used to pack around jars if a standard can a canner is not available any large metal container may be used as long as it dips enough to uh, one to two inches of briskly boiling water to cover the jars. The diameter of the canner should be no more than four inches wider than the diameter of your stove burner to ensure proper heating of, of all jars. Using a wash kettle that fits over two burners is not recommended because the metal jars do not uh, get enough heat. For an electric range, the canner must have a float bottom outdoor fire pits of, um, with a solid grade will also work. However, close attention is required to ensure proper boiling temperature. Pressure canners. The pressure canner is a specially made heavy pot with a lid that can be closed steam tight. The lid is fitted with a vent or pet cock, a dial or white pressure gauge and a safety foot. Never models have an extra power lock as added pre precaution. It may or may not have a gasket. The pressure port also has a rack because uh, each type is different. Be sure to read the direction for operating. Jars, mason jars and the bowl jars specially designed for home canning are best. Commercial mayonnaise jars, body food and pickle jar shouldn't be used. The mouth of the uh, jars may not be app appropriate for the ceiling lids and the jars are not made with heavy glass and they are not heat treated. Jars come in a variety of size from half uh, pin jars to half gallon jars. Pint and quart bowl jars are the most commonly used size and are available in regular and wide mouse tubs. If properly used, jars may be reused uh, indefinitely as long as they are kept in good conditions. At last, jar shouldn't be used for some preserving and canning. And jar lids we have most canning jars. A solid uh, salt today use a two piece of self sealing lid which consists of that metal disc with a rubber type sealing compound around one side near the uh, outer edge and a separate screw type metal band. The flat lid may only be used once, but the screw band can be used over as long as it is cleaned well and doesn't begin to rust. Here you can see canning utensils, helpful items for home canning and preserving. First one is a jar lifter, essential for easy removal of hot jars. Jar, jar funnel helps in pouring and packing of liquid and small food items into canning jars. Lead wand, uh, magnetized wand uh, for removing treated jar lids from hot water. Clean clothes, handy to have for wiping jar rims, spills, and general cleanup. Knives for preparing food, narrow flat rubber spatula for removing trapped air bubbles before sealing jars, time, uh, timer or clock for accurate food processing time, hot pads, and a cutting board. Consideration of canned products in the production of new products, application of modern products in the production of canned food. 
There are also many specialty utensils available like apple slicers, cutting spoons for coring and the pit removal, corn cutters and fruit skinners. Bottling and canning are essentially similar process in that food is filled into a container and heated to destroy enzymes and microorganisms. Fruits can be packed into jars with a hot sugar syrup and vegetables can be packed into a hot Brian. The filled jars are sealed and uh, pasteurized so that an internal vacuum forms when they are cool. The sealed container then preserves the food by preventing the contamination and uh, excluding air and sometimes light. Preservation depends on an adequate heat treatment and uh, an airtight seal. Canning is not suitable for some uh, small scale processing for the following reason. The time and temperature of canning are critically important and must be carefully controlled. If the cans are under processed, there is a risk of serious food poisoning and even death from a type of microorganisms named Clostridium botulinum. If cans are uh, overprocessed, the vegetable lose much of their texture, color, weight, vitamins, and flavor, and are not sealable. The establishment of correct heating condition depends on the, the type of food, the size and shape of the can, and the initial levels of contamination of the vegetable. This requires the skills of a qualified food technologies or microbiologist. When foods are heated in sealed uh, scan during the canning process, the temperature of sterilization is above uh, above 100 Celsius and the pressure outside the uh, can must equal that inside to prevent uh, the cans uh, from exploding. This is achieved using high pressure steam and strong vessel named uh, retort. Both steam boiler and retort are expensive and likely to be uh, beyond the means of a small scale processor. Additionally, compressed air is needed to maintain the pressure while cans are being cooled, which together with the necessary controllers adds to the capital cost of the equipment. Even if cans are available in a particular country, they are usually more expensive than other forms of packaging. Different types of products also require a particular internal lacquer uh, to prevent the metal from co corroding when it is in contact with the fruits or vegetables, and such lacquers may not always be available. In addition, a simmer is needed to seal the lid onto the can and regular checks and maintenance are necessary to ensure that the steam is properly formed. Failure in seams are not one of the main causes of spoiled or dangerous canned food. It is therefore necessary to ensure that simmer operates are fully trained and expect uh, experienced in adjusting the machines and the seam micrometer is another necessary capital expense to be able to do this. In summary, therefore, canning requires a considerable capital investment, trained and experienced staff, regular maintenance of relatively sophisticated equipment, a regular supply of the correct types of cans, and a comparatively high operating expenditure. Because of the more acidic nature of fruits, a lower processing temperature is adequate and this process is suitable for small-scale operation. In all cases, a food technologist should be consulted to advise on processing times and condition for bottled products. Canned food uh, originated after the French Revolution in order to preserve food from deterioration, the first use of the glass cans. The canning industry was born in 1810 when Durant and Englishman quickly replaced glass cans with the tin coated empty ones. By 1896, German American immigrants, men uh, among, had improved sanitary cans similar to modern cans. Corrosion res uh, resistance of tin plate and key plate.
The quality of tinted sheets is partly visible that is easily uh, ascertained by visual and simple measurements, for example, flatness, brightness, reflecting platting levels and storage time, thickness, tolerance, but more important uh, internal qualities such as corrosion resistance, acid leading, delay value, uh, tin, uh, foro yellow layer couple, test value, grain size, and even the quality of anti-oxidation, chromium layer, and oil and mechanical properties are integrated. It must rely on sophisticated testing to access and the performance and steel-based composition called rolling technology, for example, rolling process shouldn't be too much skin effect of non-metal impurity or tin plating process. Tin ion will not be plated on the surface of the steel plate. These places then form the lufal that um, microporous coating. It destroys the tin layer density, corrosion effect damage, has a very close and indirect relationship. Since the 1930s, uh, cold rolled strip steel has been tinted to reduce the unevenness of the surface layer of tin, which doesn't look skinny, shiny, in order to reduce its absorption of water molecules from the air. People put it oil, commonly used high desert, the dioctyl ester, before an uh, increase is on production line, semi-finished products after planting, plating tin, transit heating to um, 232 Celsius, then uh, quenching. The result is to get a very shiny coating surface, this process called soft melting. By the early 1950s, an American scholar had discovered that uh, tin, which melts in a soft melting sheet, seeps into the lattice of iron on the surface of a steel base, creating a thin layer of tin ferro this layer has been proved by research to have excellent corrosion resistance. He also found one uh, out of the relevant technical condition for, for forming a good allow layer, including the requirements for the composition of steel base and the temper best temperature time for heating and invented uh, the tin uh, ferro alloy layer couple. 80 suggests to determine the quality of tin ferro alloy layer. In order to com commemorate the, his invention, Posteride named this kind of high corrosion resistant tin plate after his name, Kam, which in Chinese is called key plate or key iron. Secondary cold rolled uh, plate and the chrome plate entering the 21st century, the tin plate can be used in our country, has been greatly by the former uh, 0 0.25, 0 0.23 millimeters thinning to 0 0.21 to 0 0.16 millimeters in nowadays. At the present, uh, the amount of tin coating in most cases has been reduced to 2.8 gram and uh, meter quadrat and uh, 1.1 gram for meter quadrat electro electroplating method. The more refined tin layer density increase, this more or less compensates for some of the loss of resistance to tin uh, plating. The food hygiene, on the other hand, in order to improve the corrosion resistance of empty cans and reduce the infl uh, infiltration of uh, heavy metals into food in the inner walls, people, people began to use natural and artificial resistance to coat the, the inner walls to, for empty cans since the 1930s. This can also gradually reduce the amount of tin coating on the, of the inner wall due to invention of two sides of different tin coating, different thickness of iron. Tin coating of the outer wall has long been reduced. This process has continued until now.
But since the 1980s, due to the people more and more clear understanding of harmful, harmful infiltrating ingredients in food, the requirements for commodities and environmental protection have become higher and higher. The Food and the Agriculture Organization of the United Nations, the World Health Organization, and national authorities have issued relevant regulation and standards. This form uh, from the inner wall of empty cans and printing coating films may have a move into the foot of various trees, monomers, and heavy metals has more and more strict limits, which also force people to find a better solutions. In 2006, Japan has closed the country, country's almost dozens of printing and coating production lines, or only one of the largest at the same time. Part of the European tin plate factory also announced uh, the supply of lamination electroplating tin plate. As a result of printing and coating process, environmental pollution is extremely serious. But laminated steel do not only has excellent corrosion resistance and hellless effect, but also minimal environmental pollution. The manufacturing and processing aluminum Allo sheet is always have uh, with advanced uh, aviation industry. So whether to make all kinds of ingredients, aluminum, magnesium, or aluminum, magnesium, a low cold roller sheet or shallow deep stamping of can body or a variety of easy open lid or tank bottom. The body process is more simple than the production of tin plate and more easy to control. Also are more likely to get better better to the results. Okay, here is the references. Thank you for your attention.